Hi friends, my name is Akil Ahmed and in this particular video tutorial, I will show you how to convert a CSV file into Excel file. So I thought to make some tips and tricks type of videos like when I normally load the data, migrate data from one source to another destination. So I use some tips, you know, for example, sometimes the CSV file that you are loading, it can have some issues. For example, if comma is a delimiter in your CSV file, so in some of the file, the comma can be in lower number or the comma can be in the higher number as well what i mean is if you have five column then ideally there should be four comma in the data but sometimes what happens if your columns contains uh, like addresses or they contain some comments or notes then there can be some commas available in the data so if you have some extra comma in the file then ssis won't be able to import that particular file because there are more commas so the ssis package will fail to import that kind of file so in those scenarios either you need to use the c sharp code to import those kind of bad csv file and if you have a couple of file then you can also convert the csv file into the excel file so in this video i will show you how you can do that so without wasting further time let's jump to the demo so in my d files location i got a file email.csv and if i show you the data in this particular file so it contains person's id first name last name email and gender and comma is a delimiter here so i want to convert this csv file into the excel file okay so let me close this one and now i can open the excel program from here A blank document so the first thing that we need to do is we need to click on the data tab and then from here there is an option from txt or csv and if you don't find this option here then you can also click on this one get data and then from file and here is the option from text and csv so you need to click on this particular option and now it will ask you to browse the file so my file is situated inside d files location so I can select the file and I can click on import so it will try to analyze the file so here is the delimiter option which is the comma in this particular case but for example if it is not able to identify the delimiter by itself then you can select the correct delimiter from here so we can see that the data looks good here okay so this is the data id first name last name email gender okay you can also transform the data as well like you can add new columns or you can remove the existing column but right now we won't do anything else any kind of transformation we will simply convert this data so now you can click on the load button so this will create a new excel sheet and will convert the data from the csv file into the excel file so now you can see that the original sheet name is this one sheet one and a new sheet got created here so maybe i can delete the older sheet and now this is the final sheet email okay if you want to rename the sheet name then you can also rename it otherwise you can leave it as it is and this is the data okay so now we can save this file so you can click on file then save and you can browse the location like where you want to save the file so uh, for example i want to save the file at the d files location okay so d files and i can give the file name as email as well email.xlsx so our conversion process got completed and i can close the excel file so this was the original file email.csv and a new file email.xlsx got created from this so now i can open the excel file and i can verify it so this was the way like how you can convert a csv file into the excel file so sometimes in some of the scenarios where the csv file is not good then you can try to convert it and try to load the data into the sql server or whatever is your destination yes, so i think that's it for today's video thank you guys for watching the video and if you like the video then please click the like button do subscribe to our channel, press the bell icon and click on all so that you will be notified every time I upload a new video. Thank you so much.